Um, Good morning, everyone. We're here at our egg box because we're going to talk this morning about eggs and how we got our customers and so, so we had a, how, how we sell eggs. We had a question from somebody and they said, how do you sell your eggs? Where do you get your customers? So now, we thought we'd address that. Maybe other people have yeah. the same question. Now, our, our first three customers came when we had, what, 50 hens? Be that many? I think so. I think it was around 50. And we had two of our neighbors down up, up and down the street and then one other lady that lived a little further um and they were our first three customers we didn't charge that much for eggs and eventually we we doubled in size and then doubled again and then next thing you know we had like 300 some chickens so we have <laughs> three kinds of customers yes we have our reoccurring customers, which is sort of like a CSA, but a little bit better. Um, so they have the right to increase, decrease their order, um, go on vacation. They're weekly customers. They're weekly customers, or they come every other week, and they get about the same number of eggs each time. And they pay for what they get. And, and, and they get, they get first, first, priority. first priority after our neighborhood nest who gets first priority the neighborhood nest <laughs> is a fairborn bakery mm -hmm. gluten-free mm -hmm. check them out um and they're in downtown fairborn and they are our first priority they normally get anywhere from 15 to 30 sometimes even 45 dozen in a week yeah. depending on the time of year it is and how much baking she needs to do and those have to be certified eggs which means they so, must be washed and, and refrigerated. refrigerated now on the others, they all usually go in this box, unless it is below freezing or above 100 degrees. Yeah. So we never made a video on making this box because we were just sort of winging it, but we thought we'd do a little uh, go around. So, so go ahead my, and open it my design was actually little libraries for those of you who think it looks like something else. So it's so. got a latch on it. It does have a chain to keep the door from flying open. It's got yeah. two shelves. For the eggs, so and then one for the return cartons. Each shelf is, will hold eight eggs, stack, eight dozen. Yeah, two, eight dozen. Two high, four wide. So um, we'll do 16 in here. And then you nest the cartons, which means open them up and stack them accordingly. Um, and then if you're paying cash, you can put it in there. And we always keep a couple quarters there in case you need change. Um, and if you need big chains, then just contact us. You have to us. contact us ahead of time. It is. It's high. So it's, you can see it's kind of waist high. It's on wheels. It's got uh, some handles back here so that we can move it. It's Although got, it's pretty much stayed out here since March or so. And, unless we knew there was a lot of wind. Day. It's got some hooks, so we have some bags in summertime. We'll some of them never bags. see the back side. Show the back side of the, how pretty it is back there, because they never see that back side. Uh, chickens <laughs> with eggs. Uh, the wheels came off, I think, of an old lawnmower. Uh, Always reuse, reuse, reuse. It did blow over one time in a very, very strong wind, and I had to, well, you can see the <laughs> marks right here, but I had to rebuild the, the, the roof wood, uh, it cracked otherwise it, oh. it stays kind of warm in there in the in the winter time so because of the metal roof it does keep temp but this we really don't put eggs out until about maybe 15 minutes to a half an hour before you say you're coming that's plexiglass so right always there. always give me a uh, heads up before you come either by text or google or facebook message or um, speaking of those kind of things, besides cash, we also accept Venmo, Apple Pay, Google Pay, which has a new app, so make sure you download it, um, and, cash app. and Cash App, which I haven't really used for that much, but my husband does. I think we're set up so. to take Facebook Pay. We but just I don't know about yet. that yet, so just try one of those others first. <laughs> or Cash. Cash is always good. Foxy glass on the it's adhered and there is a glue along here as well. There's an overhang, keeps the weather out, keeps the moisture. Right. If 
found we needed to latch on here just to make sure that it did stay latched because some people would push it in and then it would open. So it's we had to put a latch on the side just to make sure. Out here. Uh, yeah. And then you wanted to show it's maple syrup time. Yep, it's time of year that people tap. So if we ever start getting some above freezing temperatures, then then we are high crank. Then we're gonna be making some maple syrup. So this is Crank. I call him Crankosaurus. Yeah, he's a very friendly boy, very young. Yeah. <laughs> By the way, I'm looking for corn. You got corn? Of course I do. Uh, all right, well that's it. I hope that helps. Uh, it's we're so thankful for the customers that we have. They find us on Google, which is a very big thing these days because you can't do um, Facebook Marketplace for eggs anymore. Facebook Marketplace won't let you so, advertise eggs. Eh? So you can advertise on Craigslist, You can, which we don't. We advertise on our page. We um, do Google, which brings in customers from, you know, an hour away will come to this yeah. farm because they cannot find you so please advertise some way to find them there's so, local hens local harvest they will that will get people to your eggs so we're very grateful for the customers we have and the new customers we are accepting some new customers uh, just because it's spring and the girls are starting to lay and we have the scraps for eggs program if any of you want to belong to that you just have to be able to come weekly to get um eggs and drop off your scraps and here in the next few days you'll see a post on the rent a chick program so we're about to start that in april so. oh. <laughs> all right well thanks for watching nancy jack, enjoy your breakfast and jack jack's experiencing some nice time outside <laughs> <laughs> we will see you soon on the homestead bye everyone bye.